Los Angeles, with America's second largest Jewish population, finally has kosher at Dodger Stadium at the ma Major League Baseball game. Not Anaheim Stadium, but at Dodger Stadium, thanks to Jeff. What problem did you guys come in with a solution to? Uh, well, you know, kosher consumers at Dodger Stadium didn't have an option until uh, we had a stand at the stadium, and uh, now they do. Instead of uh, buying at the store and carrying it into the stadium, they have hot, fresh options at the stadium when they get to see the game. Caught up. The Dodgers finally caught up with reality. Kosher stands in New York in both Mets Stadium and Yankee Stadium, in both Chicago stadiums, I believe at least the Cubs Stadium, in Baltimore, in Toronto, in D Cleveland, and uh, I don't know about Detroit, maybe Detroit also. They, for years they've had kosher. Now I know they have more Jews in those locations than they have in Los Angeles, but there's enough Orthodox Jews in Los Angeles to merit having at least one uh, kosher stand at Dodger Stadium for 50 or so nights of, of the season where we can't be here Friday night for Shabbos or for the, any of the Jewish holidays. But that's the point. The Dodgers have finally come on board that, that, that there's a big business for this. And as you see, even non-Jews and, and non-religious Jews like these kind of hot dogs. Yes. I know there's going to be a well. big overlap of people eating kosher <laughs> and rooting for the Mets, I think. Are exactly. you Josh Molina? I am. Are you? Uh, did you seek this particular standout? Indeed, I did. I'm a big fan of Jeff's kosher hot, uh, sausages and hot dogs uh, on Pico Boulevard. How easy when you want? Are you kosher? Yes. So when you when you came to a Dodger game, yes. what was it available to eat for you? Uh, popcorn, <laughs> peanuts, beer, soda. And if you had come straight from work and you wanted something substantial for dinner, popcorn, <laughs> peanuts, yes. beer, soda. It was a disgrace that we didn't have kosher hot dogs here. Of course. Did you come here specifically? Cost me, cost me 35 years to get those in here. I'm coming here 35 years already. <laughs> you feel like it, so if they had Hebrew National, would have been sufficient for you? No, okay. not at all. It's not glad. It's not glad. Not kosher enough. No. Do you think that they make this accessible enough, or or no, ought to be got to move Jeff's in the middle? I'm trying, but it isn't going to work so fast. All right. This is my friend Hershey Critch here. Hi there, how are you? No, what, what'd you get? What'd you get? Two hot dogs with sauerkraut, and we'll put on some uh, mustard. You're at the only kosher hot dog stand in the... If, if you were in left field, you wouldn't be here. But because you're in right field, did you seek this place out? I didn't seek it out. I was walking by, and I got one of their sausages, and it was delicious, so I decided to come back. And I am in left field, by the way. <laughs> Which one did you get? I got the chipotle, uh, the jalapeno dog. How about you, sir? Uh, I followed his direction. He said they were really good. <laughs> Does the fact that it's kosher deter you or entice you in any way? Uh, entices me more than it deters me. What does that convey, the, the notion of kosher? It's healthy, clean, uses, uh, clean animals, cleanly raised animals. How much how many of the customers here come because it's kosher, and how many come because they, they just think it's better quality? Um, we get a lot of customers that are here specifically because it's kosher. But a lot of the customers are starting to learn about what kosher is, and the second they taste it, they, they give up the old dogs, and, and they're here every game. In fact, they're upset when they come on Fridays and Saturdays, and we're not here because we're closed for Shabbos. <laughs> so that's the goal. The goal is hopefully to create a business beyond just the Jewish community here. You get fans telling you you're the best hot dog in the ballpark? Yeah, fans will, will come by and tell us that these dogs top any other dog in the park. And they'll come by and order They'll order one, and then they'll come back ten minutes later and order two more. Did you seek this particular stand out, or is it just coincidence? No, I did seek it out. They have uh, the best food ever. Got it way better than a Dodger dog. What? Make sure nobody sees me. <laughs> and you're not ordinarily kosher, but... I'm not ordinarily kosher, but kosher tastes good. And are you sitting near the stand, or did you have to travel a little, little way? Um, no, actually, we're sitting on the other side. We're sitting on the third base side. So you're on the left field side, but you had to come all the way. And That's correct. And we ought to have one on the third base side as well. well actually, we should have one behind. We should have one on first base. We should have one on, uh, on behind the plate also. We should have one all over the place. Probably not.